rejected by Ewing. Got it. Wants a goal tap. They will not get it. 51 percent. The Bulls, 36 percent. Shot clock down to three. Jordan rejected by Ewing. Ewing stepping out, knocked it away. Elijah on the recovery block by Ewing. Ewing with an enormous play, rejecting Elijah. That's his fourth block of the game. Here's Pippen, rejected by Ewing. criticizing Patrick for not being active in games three and four. But I'll tell you, tonight, he is everywhere. Tied 14. That's going nowhere but in the score. Oh, that, that's a terrific move by Scotty. Scotty takes it strong, but once again, transition defense. See, the Knicks are schooled defensively. Patrick back, even though his man is not in the picture. Clock at four. Well, Patrick Ewing at seven blocks in game three, just waiting on Carl Herrera. It seems like he's the guy he's picking on most, has a good feeling of when he's going to release the ball and swats away. Anderson inside, rejected by Ewing, his fifth with two tenths of a second left. They'll probably add one tenth. Now, he remember, right now, now this watch, as he leans in, here comes Ewing, and he catches that. Now, that's the third block. In the early part of the season, it was Oakley. Now, it's been Mason, and whoever is at the top of the game. Ewing with that block on four, but then he lost it. Here comes Fox. Not many fast breaks in this second quarter, but this is what will start him. A great block on Otis Thorpe by Patrick Ewing. Seconds gets it down. Oh, oh, what a save by Ewing with the rejection. A spectacular ending to the first half. What a terrific effort by Patrick Ewing, who took that jump shot, not quite on the baseline, but a 45 degree gets all the way back to somehow or other I'll race that ball and catch up with Elijah Wan's little hook to save the day for the New York Knicks at the end of the...